Okay, so here is a problem that I have been having. This is something I can do with Ableton, but I so far cannot figure out how to do it with PreSonus Studio One, and I would like to be able to do it in Studio One. So, <clears throat> here I have this FM8 patch that I created uh, from a tutorial online, and um, it's basically like kind of a wub wub monster bass. So what Ableton allows you to do is it allows you to have this, it's got this instrument rack down here, and so each individual component that you get along inside of the matrix, you can then map it to one knob. So for example, I have it down here, it shows up down here in the FM8, and I can map it to this knob. Well this knob has already been set to map all these other parameters that you see up here. And what's awesome is you can then go up to here, macro mappings, and you can set the minimum and maximum that it's going to uh, go to when you turn the knob. So I could set this to like 0.3, like 30%. And so now every time I turn the knob, you'll see down over here, it only goes up to 30. And all these other ones stay at their numbers that I set them to. Just 32, 8, if you look at the corresponding down here, 32 and 8 control all these five six parameters with just one knob now I know there's a way to I, I I'm actually really not sure how to do this in presonus um, so if you have any tips for me about how to make this happen I would be very very much obliged because I because it because then I could go back to using um, studio one which I would really love because it's much better, I think, for recording um, acoustic instruments as well as electronic stuff. Um, but just for the heck of it, I'll go into my actual um, Studio One here, and I'll show you. I have this exact same patch. Let's see. Yeah, so, um, see I can only control one at a time, and it doesn't give me the same effect. So if anybody knows how I can fix this, that would be awesome. I want to make it work in Personas. Thank you.